Good evening, here's our top story. New York Mayor Michael Bloomberg says that the Occupy Wall Street protesters are trying to destroy jobs. Bloomberg suggested that the best way to destroy jobs is to get a job on Wall Street. <laughs> a new poll of Iowa Republicans shows that Herman Cain is right behind Mitt Romney. So Romney called the police to report who was being followed closely by a black man. <laughs> A new report suggests that the birth rate has dropped sharply due to the recession. The results are unexpected given how many people in this lousy economy have been screwed. <laughs> On Tuesday, the City Council of Topeka, Kansas voted to repeal the law that makes domestic violence a crime. However, the law said it actually just fell down the stairs. <laughs> A stray meteorite from a nearby meteor shower crashed through the roof of a Paris home this week, commented the house's owner, That meteor was horrible! <laughs> it marked the first time there was ever a shower inside of a Frenchman's house. Foot <laughs> <laughs> show on current TV, which makes her the only person from Michigan in four years to get a job. <laughs> and now, where hard news meets Hollywood, here with the entertainment news is our own Cosmo Kawanga. <laughs> I can't believe I went on a talk show with that weird thing, said the goat. <laughs> huh? Miley Cyrus visited Haiti to help a charity hand out hearing aids to hearing impaired children. Commented Cyrus. The kids were like totally excited to get their hearing aids, and then I like started singing, and they like took them out of their ears and threw them in the trash can. <laughs> Haitian kids are like, Weird, y'all. <laughs> it's the clown. <laughs> Penny Marshall of Laverne and Shirley turned 69 on Saturday, marking the first time the words Penny Marshall and 69 were uttered in the same uh, sentence. <laughs> what? <laughs> and finally. Bruce Willis will star in a new Die Hard movie to be released in 2013. To better reflect Willis's age, the film will be called Die Flaccid. <laughs> You're welcome. Thank you, Cosmo. You're welcome. Robin Gibb of the Bee Gees was hospitalized on Thursday due to abdominal pain. Commented his doctor. I think it's only appropriate to share with you Robin Gibbs, Robin Gibbs excuse me, uh, diagnosis um, in song. <clears throat> Is he all right? Is he okay? I will tell you today whether you're a brother or whether you're a brother. He's <clears throat> in critical condition. <laughs> were hospitalized after accidentally eating brownies that contained marijuana. The senior citizens reported having feelings of dizziness and confusion. And then they ate the pot brownies. <laughs> Health experts in the UK warn that gonorrhea outbreaks in Britain are becoming untreatable. They aren't concerned about an epidemic, however, since no one actually wants to have sex with a British person. <laughs> In New Mexico, a burglary suspect was identified and arrested when he left behind his cell phone at the house. The burglar later admitted it was a bad idea to check into the house on Foursquare. <laughs> a nudity activist completely disrobed while she appeared in a New York court on charges of public nudity, commented her lawyer. My client is innocent. She only disrobed because she thought she would get a hung jury. <laughs> Ah, uh, it's bad, because now she's been serviced to 30 hours of community cervix. <laughs> fortunately, uh, fortunately, I'm doing her case pro boner. 
Voir dire the witness. Watch my cousin Vinny, for God's sake. New research says that having sex can cause some t people to have temporary amnesia, which is why I always forget to ask if he's 18. <laughs> Not my fault at all. He was four. <laughs> Young, dumb, and full of love. <laughs> Cheerios. The hole in the center. Okay. It was revealed on the Dan Patrick show that in the late 90s, the New York Mets had a porn room in their clubhouse. And they also considered changing their name to the New York Yankers. <laughs> and now, with an in depth look at one of the week's big stories, is the segment that's twice as important as AC 360.